There's more rumbling in the media jungle today with some of the biggest players trying to shake up the way business is done. Rupert Murdoch's News Limited has made an almost $2 billion offer for James Packer's consolidated media holdings. If the deal goes through, the Murdoch empire will double its stake in Australia's pay TV business. Finance correspondent Philip Lasker is at News Limited headquarters in Sydney. So, Phil, what's been announced today? Well, so far, what we do know, as you've mentioned, Roz, is that bid by News Limited for Consolidated Media. Now, James Packer has 50% of Consolidated Media. Kerry Stokes has around 24%. But uh, the big thing is that uh, Consolidated Media has 25% of Foxtel and 100% of Fox Sports. So if this deal was to go ahead, uh, Rupert Murdoch would end up with 50% of Foxtel with Telstra and 100% of Fox Sports. And we know that Rupert Murdoch is big in sporting broadcasts around the world. He's offered uh, $3.50 a share, which is about 14% above yesterday's close. Uh, the share price last time I checked was $3.43, so it's picked up uh, quite a bit. The other thing that uh, News Limited is doing is, is buying Business Spectator, the online business publishing group. Uh, that uh, the speculation there is he's buying it for around $30 million. That has a, uh, a, a free online access to business news, but also has the subscription-only Eureka report. So what we're seeing today is, a, is, a, is an expression of where Murdoch's priorities are. Uh, pay TV with the revenues that come with that, and also uh, the online digital environment. Well, it seems James Packer wants to sell up because he has his eyes on another prize. Well, that's right. Uh, James Packer, uh, it's no secret that James Packer has been winding down his involvement in the media. If he sells this, he'll end up with about a 7% stake in the 10 network, and that's about it. Um, it will also give him a billion dollars in cash to focus on casinos and we know uh, he wants to buy Echo, uh, Echo Entertainment, the Star uh, Casino, because uh, speculation is that he wants that license to perhaps, perhaps build a grander casino in Sydney. He already has casinos in Macau, in Las Vegas, and uh, that's where uh, part of his business priorities lie. All right, and Phil, there is speculation that News Limited may also be uh, announcing big job cuts today following those sweeping cuts at Fairfax earlier this week. Briefly. Well, the speculation is another th a thousand jobs to go at News Limited following uh, the Fairfax cuts of 1900. Again, it's all associated with the shift to digital, uh, aligning costs with where the revenue streams are, and uh, downgrading the emphasis on print media. Phil, thank you.